Hey guys, today I'm going to be teaching you how to use the new App Inventor for Android Beta. So let's just go and create a new project file. Um, let's just call this, if you don't know what you're doing um, yet, because there's so many features that you can use in the app, it's just really amazing. So I'm just name it app to begin with, or test, or project. So go into that, because you see all these great things that you can use, and you can always change it later by going into Save As, and then the name of it. All right. So first thing we're going to do is you're going to put a button in. Um, you want to have your phone connected and go into your settings, development, or I mean applications, development, mock locations, orientation, screen lock, if you have that, and stay awake during USB debugging, if you're familiar with the clips. Okay, so this is App Inventor for Android. You have to be invited to use it, so I'm just going to go into a new tab. And then um, let's go to Google and okay. So I'm gonna provide us the form, like the the form that you have to fill out in the description. Let's copy that now. So you have to t complete a form and then you know take the form, sign it out, and then you should get an email saying that you're allowed in. It takes about like a week or two. So. All right, once you're pretty much invited into this, then come back to this video, so. All right, let's go into uh, File, New Tab, Google, and let's get an image for our button. Let's just take Should be good size. Okay. So we have that icon now. Go back into and go into image, add, choose file, and resize of 300 pixels. Okay. So you want to delete the text off. So now um, you want to go into media and drag the camera over into it. And then you want to add another button. Button two. Go back to this. And we'll call this one. Take this. All right, so go an image and choose file like we did, and Twitter icon. Click OK, OK, and then over that, let me just delete this text. And I'm sorry that they're different sizes; it's not gonna matter really. Um, you can go into social and drag your Twitter over your Twitter icon. All right, so once you've done that, you want to go and have your phone. I have your phone connected and everything that I instructed. Go into Open Blocks Editor. And then it should come up in your downloads. Just don't do anything. It should do it all itself. And you can delete them from your downloads if you want. So it's a, it's a Java web application. So let's let it load for a second. Okay. So then click Connect to Phone. It should start connecting into your phone. So you're communicating, and as soon as it is done, it should just say screen one. It said listening to Ad Inventor, little notification should come up, and then your screen should be white with little icons. Okay, once you have all this, go to My Blocks, button one. And this is the thing I love about Ad Inventor it's so simple because when button one is clicked, the action is going to perform. So when it's clicked, it's going to do or open camera one, camera or picture. Um, button two. When button two is clicked, it's going to just pretty much open the. So let's just look for the one that says.
It should be Twitter authorized. I'm pretty sure. All right. So that's my bad about the whole Twitter thing. You have to get a. Uh, on I'm trying to see the website. Twitter.com slash OR. So you have to get a. Okay, so. Um, we're not going to be able to use Twitter right now because it's, there's so many problems with it. This is really annoying. So we're just going to change the button to something else. Just to use this button again. Control and control button. Alright. So once you have that, um let's just change let's make this one email picker. Oh that's that's so much better. Um who wants contact me? Okay, there's another one button that's called that. Contact people. So now let's go to new tab. Google. It's probably not going to work, so let's go to the other one. Okay, let's make this one. Okay, so now we have a big contacts icon. Um, delete all the text, of course. Um, that's your contact picker. Um, so yeah, so when you click on, on the contacts icon, show up your contacts, and it'll show. It doesn't show your contacts how you have them. It shows them a lot easier. Um, it shows the number you recently called, an email that you sent an email to, an email you saved, and then it should show all your contacts and emails, like everything that you put in there. So. That's all your contacts, and you click on the camera, and it starts up your camera, and let's take a picture. And then it, you can click OK or retake, so let's click OK. And it takes you back to your app. So, let's go back to the blocks editor. And we're going to take a picture, and camera one. So after picture, you want to forget that. That should be like that. Control, click control one. I'm sorry, this video is taking so long because there's a lot to put in. Okay, so now I just changed the camera settings. So let's go try that. Can I take a picture? And then click OK. It doesn't really do much anything different. Okay, I don't want to do that camera. I want to do that. So, so that's pretty much just the basics of this app. You can you can do a lot. Um, you can just do whatever apps you want. So that's why I love about it. Um, or you can add like a texting. That that's pretty cool. So I'm gonna connect to my phone and I'll test that out. 
my box. Oh, yeah, I come with Jerry Jordan. I just hate the pixel art. Okay. So, um, that should be that's all I have. Phone number. That's a weird phone number for Jerry Jordan. Alright, so your scene is enabled, so all this stays there. And then as soon as you click on um, SMS icon, it goes straight into your contacts and you can select um, all the other people here. So, I guess we'll do it for test. Alright, so. When you get your contact, so when you touch your wrist, you can get it received. When you receive it, you want it to come like this. Alright, um, it's I'm a little bit confused. I hate to say it because it's it's just it takes a lot of time, and I don't want to I don't want to fit all that in right now. So um, that is just the basic app, the basic video. So thank you for watching.